So Google Sheets has a function called sort in, and it works kind of like the sort function and kind of like a filter function, but it does things that neither of them can really do. And I'll show you the sort in function on this range of data above here. If you look at it, you'll notice there's a low value that's a two and a high value that's a five. And then I put in two of the middle value. That's going to make it easier to show you the different ways that we can run it. But right now, let's just do it with a two, which is saying return the first two values. I hit enter, it gives me a two and a three. So you can see that you might desire a different output. Maybe that's what you want, but you might want to show all the instances of the lowest values, right? So there's two threes. So if you want that, you go back in, hit a comma, and the second parameter is the display ties mode. If you leave it out, it only displays the first two. But if you put it in as a one, it'll show all the instances of the ties. And you see it wrote out both threes. So in this example, I actually added a number two so that you could see what was happening a little bit easier. I'm going to say give me the top three results, but then my displays tie mode is going to be a two. And what that two is going to say is that I want the top three, but I don't want you to show any duplicates of those three. So if you look at the result, it's the top three numbers without any of the duplicates of the numbers. So if two is one of the numbers, but there's three twos, it's only going to show one of them. If you use a three, it'll show the top three since we specified number three and the displays tie parameter of three says if there's any duplicates, show them all for the top three numbers. So we hit enter, it shows me both twos, both threes, and since there's that's only two different numbers, show me the third one as well, which is five.